you guys, Dylan Schumacher, Citadel Defense, and uh, today I wanted to give you an update on the F8 sights that I have had on my Glock 19 for a while. I replaced these uh, earlier this spring when I removed the big dot sights that I previously had on this gun and went with the F8 sights. So for those of you who haven't seen them, here is what they look like. Uh, there we go. So, uh, big fan of these so far. I've got out to just a lot so far this year and I've been to shoot them, able to shoot them a lot. And a couple things that I continue to enjoy about them. Initially, one of the things that I said I really liked was the fact that this is a deep, deep rear sight, so that provides single hand manipulations. Uh, it makes it much easier to do single hand manipulations, which has proven true. Uh, I've racked this off my belt, I've racked this off my holster. Um, done a lot of work with that rear sight and it continues to hold up and it's great. The other thing of course that I like a lot is that huge, huge front orange dot right there. Uh, the camera doesn't come across very well on the camera but let me tell you right now, it is big. It's a big, big front dot. And I like that because it's really easy to pick up. Now I initially switched these away from the big dots because although the big dot itself is easy to pick up, the problem is that the uh, big dot itself doesn't really allow for precision. And what I mean when I say precision is like an eight inch circle at 25 yards, okay? That's what I'm talking about. And I had a really difficult time hitting that with those big dots, and especially when I want to push it out to 50 yards. So I want to be able to do 58 inch circle at 50 yards, and was not able to do it uh, consistently with those big dots. And uh, I moved to this in hopes that I could accomplish that uh, while still having a, an easy to pick up front sight. Well, turns out uh, you can. You can do that. Uh, at, at 25 and 50 yards, I'm able to hit 8 inch circles with these sights. So, big, big fan of that. That uh, simple sight switch has, has allowed me to start doing that. So, real, real happy with that. Additionally, I will say, because this sight is so large and easy to pick up, it's super helpful for people uh, as you get older and have a tougher time seeing the front sight. Um, I was out with a student. They had a, a Glock uh, 22 and then some standard Glock night sights on the gun and we were at 25 yards and they were just struggling to hit the target and, and the uh, student mentioned to me that, you know, hey, I'm getting older and I just, I can't get a hard front sight and like, I won't focus on that hard front sight. So he was just kind of lining up blurry sights because he just, he, you know, his eye wouldn't focus. Uh, and I said, well, here, try it with this gun, try it with mine. And uh, right away, shooting instantly improved because he was able to see the front sight. He could focus on that. Uh, it was big enough that, that even, you know, as his eyes got older, he could focus on that and you could actually see what he was shooting. So that made a big difference. So again, so far I am much more a fan of these sights than I thought I would have been and I would highly recommend that you put them on your gun. Uh, in my opinion, they're the best of both worlds. One world, of course, being the traditional sight picture, you know, the notch and post, which these are, and then the other world being that big dot, you know. Uh, which I, I like, I, I still like for 10 yards and in, I think big dots are king. Uh, but this, I get pretty much all of the advantages of the big dot and I get that precision at distance that I've been aiming for. So huge, huge fan of the F8s from XS Sight Systems. I would highly recommend them to you. If you're looking at them, go ahead and add them. Uh, Dylan Schumacher, Citadel Defense, do brave deeds and endure.